What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening and today we are back with Fates Collide Box 6 part number 2. So it is a sad sad day. We are on our way to closing off the booster case opening but we are here with another 9 boost packs. Part number 1 was hype. We got some good stuff. Part number 1 is always like, it always tends to be really like just solid. You always just get something good. But, 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 we are here today with part two with another nine boost packs. I'll just double check that that is nine. So what's that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes. It is, it is nine boost packs. But with that said, let's just get straight into these packs without too much commentary going down, if you know what I'm saying. If you know what I'm saying, but let's go. So let's throw this one off the back. I will give out some codes throughout the video, so make sure you stay tuned throughout to scoop up those codes. But we have a Burmy, a Coughing, Meowth, Lavatar, a Diglett, Kangaskhan, Duosion, Scorched Earth, a Mega Catcher, and a Reuniclus Regular Rare. So no first pack magic. That is no good. That is no good. Next pack, we got the perfect Zygarde pack art. But yes. So my hopes, my hopes for this box has not quite come through yet, but we are hoping for another Umbreon EX, or an Umbreon EX full art, Glaceon EX full art, or a... Well, we actually... <laughs> I, can't, I can't really continue that because that'll spoil the first part. So let's continue on. I've already got one of my uh, hopes for this box, I guess you could say. But yes, we got a Chinchino, a Kangaskhan, Duosion, a Wisma Reverse, that was just a common, and a Lucario Holo. Holo! With 110 HP with Vacuum Wave and Fight Alone. Cool, so let's throw this one up the back. Actually, let's set these packs up at the back here, just like that. And then we got something to lean against now. Cool. So let's do that. And let's move on to the next pack up. So we got Mega Alakazam. Whoops, this pack is shredding. Whoops, 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 whoops. Packs, pack shreds everywhere. There we go, there is the code. And let's see what pack number three, I think it's pack number three, has in store for us. So we've got a Vullaby, a Lavatar, Cottony, Coughing, Spoink, Mega Catcher, Wigglytuff, Dugong, a Reverse N. That's pretty cool. That's not a bad pull. And a regular rare Lugia. I love pulling this regular rare. Like, you barely see it, but I oh, know. I like it. It's got pressure and intensifying burn. That is awesome. That is awesome. So, throw those. The, I think that pack had two pretty good pulls. We got a Reverse N, and then we got the regular rare Lugia. But next pack. Del Fox break. So yeah, I'm so glad like um this case has come through once again and we have managed to pull every single full art and secret rare from the set just like breakthrough did. Uh, my break point one, we missed out by one card being the Espeon EX full art, which sucks. Sucks so bad. I would have loved to have had one of those. Uh straight off the bat, but it's okay. So we got a Chinchino and a Reverse Rare Barbarical. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> and the regular Rare Barbarical. So two Barbarical, one pack. Not bad. Not even bad. But yeah, the Barbarical has Hand Block and Claw Slash. Alrighty, so what's that? We got five more packs left in part number two of box number six. So we got the Lugia Break pack art. Carry it up the back. And let's go. Let's go. Hopefully we can get some goodness in today's part. Because we did not actually, by fact, get any sort of full art pull from part number one. I can say that, can't I? I think I, think I can say that, and that's not really a spoiler. But, um, yes. So we are hoping for two full arts in this box. So we got a reverse Loudred, which is just an uncommon. And... Genesect, leave me alone. God damn, god damn it. 
I think this is like the third Genesect from the case. I'm sorry, like spoilers going left, right and center. This is like, I swear, this is my fourth Genesect. So I got one at the pre-release. I got one in like box number one, I think. Box number three, box number, I don't know. I, I lost count already, but this makes four Genesects in my collection. What? Stop it. Stop it, Genesect. Ugh. I thought you were cool at the pre-release. I thought you were cool, and now you're just haunting me. Oh, no. I guess it's not that bad a card to be haunted by, because Genesect's pretty powerful, and it's got some pretty solid cards in the TCG. But yes, it has the ability Drive Change and the attack of Rapid Blaster. So let's just have one last shot there. Check that out, guys. Nice texture. Nice shine. Anyway... Let's move on. Actually, let's throw that one in a sleeve. I got some sleeves next to me. I got some matte uh, Ultra Pros just there. So let's throw that in a sleeve and throw that one up back. So we got the perfect Zygarde. I can't believe we got. Oh, damn it! Couldn't it be like an Umbreon case? That that'd be muchly appreciated. Just straight Umbreon. God damn it, Genesect. I think I've pulled more of the full art Genesect than I have of the regular Genesect EX. How crazy is that? That is what? Oh dear. Oh dear, we got a Wormadam, we got a Fossil Excavation Kit, Alakazam Spirit Link, a Reverse Riolu, and a regular rare Mr. Mime. How crazy is that? I think I have pulled more full art Genesects than what I have of the regular EX Genesect. But here we go, guys. There is the code for you guys. Enjoy. Enjoy, enjoy. I can't believe that. Another Genesect. But we got a Dealing. Snivy. Jigglypuff. Fennekin. Snubble. Brakeson. Whimsicott. Whoops, taking two cards, as I do. Fairy Garden. Reverse Dealing. And a regular rare X Bloud. Okay, so we got two more packs left in part number two. So we, I think, going off general ratios, we've got two pulls so far. So we'd be expecting one more pull out of these last two packs, whether it be a Hollow EX or yeah. But let's give away another code. Let's go back to back codes. How's that? Throw that one off to the side. Let's go. So we've got a Solosis, a Gothita. I'm just, I'm just gonna say, guys, I can see something. I can totally see something. You guys can't. Oh, I think you can just see it at the top there, but I can totally see something right now. We got a Wisma. Please be an Umbreon. Please, 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 please. We got a Whimsicott, a Zygarde, Wormadam, a Reverse Rare Exploit. I think I've seen this before. I think I've seen this before. No, <laughs> we get a Kingdra. That is all good. That is still pretty cool. Damn it. I was so hoping for an Umbreon. We have to get one in this last box. We, we so just have to get one. But yes, we have a Kingdra EX. Which this is one of the um, nicer looking EXs in the set. Like it just, I oh know. It looks really clean. In comparison to, oh, who could I compare it to? Ordino. <laughs> Ordino. Ordino just makes this look amazing. But yes, it's got Big Storm and Dragon Trail. Well, nice pull. Let's throw that one in a sleeve as well. Get all these Ultras in their sleeves. Nice. So these, like, matte sleeves, they give it, like, a nice finish. You can't really, like, see much of the shine, as you guys can see there. That's why I try to keep them out until the end of the video. But, um, yeah. They do a good job, and they look nice in general, so that's cool. Just your Ultra Pro matte sleeves, matte finish. But yes, last pack, we've got the Lugia Break Pack Art. So this is the last pack from the left-hand side of the box. So let's get this out. Sorry if I keep taking it off camera. I'm just trying to like hide the code so you guys can't see the back of it, because the back spoils the poles. Actually, you guys can have this code. So there we go. Yeah, the back of the code card definitely is a spoiler. So I try not to look at them. Like, I place them facing up towards me off to the side. But let's go. Let's even get that hashtag last pack magic. 
So we got a Snubble, a Burmy, Cotney, Fairy Drop, Loudred, Kabuto, a Reverse Carbink. That one is the Safeguard Carbink, so that's a good one. And then, 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 a regular rare Kabutop. So no hashtag last pack magic in this part either. Hashtag spoiler. But we did get some nice pulls. We got some nice stuff. We got Haunted by Genesect. That is like my troll from the set, I'd say. Like in Ultras, Genesect is the troll. But yes, we've got the Reverse Rare x -Bloud. Reverse Rare Barbarical. Hollow Lucario. Not bad, not bad, not bad. We got the Kingdra EX. You can't really see the shine too much because of the sleep, but that's all good. You guys get the picture. And we got the Genesect EX Full Art. So that brings me to the question of the video being, from Fates Collide, what card has trolled you the most? What card have you pulled that you really just have not wanted to pull? Like, obviously being a holo or better. So for example, if you have pulled a lot of Lucario holos, but you have really not wanted to pull this holo because you're hoping for something better, let me know in the comment section below about that. And if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like down below. Let me know in the comment section below about that. Subscribe if you're new to my channel or if you just enjoyed today's opening. And I look forward to seeing you guys in part number three or another one of my Pokemon videos. Thanks for watching. Peace.